What up guys, it's Tops, and welcome back to Let's Play Mario Kart 8. And today, uh, in this video, I am here with... Super Ouija X, yeah. So, uh, I'm gonna be playing the Flower Cup in this episode. I might have said that I was gonna be doing the Shell. I'm not really sure, but yeah, I'm gonna be doing the Flower. We're gonna go through the new tracks, and then through the retro ones afterwards. Uh, so, I'm going to be using Luigi in this episode, uh, because Super Luigi X is here with us. So, out of honor of that, I guess, I'll be using Luigi in this Yay. video. Alright. Um, so, let's start the Grand Prix right here. Uh, so, yeah, Super Luigi X, he doesn't have this game yet, but <laughs> he's probably going to end up getting it at some point. But he could see the screen, so uh, he could see me playing it. Yep. So, you got anything you want to say? I don't even know. Any influential words? What do you mean? Influential words give some, like, speech about stuff that's important. I, I don't know. I just want um. this game, kind of, ish. Wait, so why aren't you using <laughs> your me? Oh, because I decided that if I changed up the wheels a little bit, like I changed them to different wheels, and it pretty much has similar stats to a heavyweight Luigi. Oh uh, yeah, guys, if you don't know what he meant by that, it's because uh, before I was gonna use a Luigi me so I could have him be heavyweight, because I'm really good at heavyweight characters in this game. I don't know. I always play with medium and lightweights in Mario Kart Wii and 7, but in uh, this game, just heavyweights have been, like, perfect for me. I don't know. I think they're just, like, balancing is a little bit different in this game and it suits me more so i've just been playing with a lot of heavyweights but i changed the tires to these tires the standard blue tires which are they have the same stats as the standard tires but they're blue instead of black uh but when i changed them to this it pretty much evened out the stats from like a medium to a higher class because i was using the roller tires before but now with these ones here it's pretty much the same thing as using a heavyweight. Or at least one in the uh, cruiser class, which is like the lighter of the heavyweight classes. Alright, so now that I got all that like rambling going on, uh, let's actually get to the gameplay. Wait, you're seeing this live, right? Mm hmm. Oh, okay, good. Uh, Alright, so, you know, like right now I just threw that bomb on, right? Yeah. And almost blew myself up? Yeah. Yep, alright. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that, actually. Alright, so, uh, we're in third place now. It's, uh, pretty good, I guess. I I'm gonna try and get in first, of course. Oh, I almost got hit by that blue shell. I can't even really see what this blue bird's doing. Okay, I think I'm gonna be fine, though. So I'm gonna try and get from fifth to first, because, you know, that's how you win. You know, you get in the first place. Uh, but, yeah, it looks like it's not gonna be too hard, because... Coming up right up here, seven coins now, uh, with the banana protecting me. Luckily, I didn't get the freaking coin item, and now I'm probably going to get it at this next item box. I probably just jinked, uh, jinxed myself. I always do in this game uh, when I say I'm doing really good and stuff. I was playing but Mario 64 right now. Super Mario 64? Yep, I have nothing better to do. Alright, go play some Super Mario 64 then. You could do this. Are you going to try and PB or something? I guess I could. It's kind of unprofessional yeah, for me to be playing this while we're trying to do a collab, but I don't know. Yeah, I mean, it's it's alright. Super Mario 64 is the best game of all time, so it doesn't matter. Um, guys, if you don't know what uh, I meant by PB, PB means personal best. It's a speedrunning term. That means like when you get your best time on something in a speedrun. Oh, my controller just dropped. Okay. I think everyone in the video was pleased to have heard your controller drop, definitely. Yes, yes, very much. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, wasn't you? Yeah, not really. I think I started that way too early. Yep, I knew it. Oh, I started that, like, a split second too early, and I ended up not getting the boost, but being stopped. But it's okay, because I'm going to get this item box right here. And... Piranha plant. That's kind of weird that I got a piranha plant. I think when I got the item box, I wasn't at second. I was at like six or something, and that's why I got this. I don't really know, but I'm going to kill you, Mario. Oh, uh, never mind. 
you're too far away. Um, probably should have taken that shortcut route instead of this main one, but whatever, I'll do that next lap. And whoa, that I was gonna take the buildings up there, but that trolley just blocked my path. So I guess I'm not going to. Uh, so I'll just stay down here. Okay, good, I got another item box. Having a coin is the worst item in this, and I get another freaking coin. But uh, it's really bad because you can only hold one item on you at once, which means that you're stuck with that coin. So you could either just use it and get two more coins, save it. But what you can't do is get another item because you'll have to wait until you get to the next item boxes. It's not like how in Mario Kart Wii would have been able to just have like a shell also, um, you know, like, and get the coin at the same time. Because if it was like that, it would have been okay somewhat because you know like if you got a coin you weren't totally screwed until you got to the next item boxes but in this game it's like that so you really don't want to get those coins and if you do you want to be really cautious because you could get easily hit by red shells or green shells or even anything actually uh that comes from behind and right here i'm screwed because there's no way to defend against the blue shell unless you have mushrooms which is actually really hard to do with mushrooms so if there's any other way that you could dodge the blue shell, I recommend doing that rather than mushrooms. Uh, but mushrooms you can't even get at first place, so you would have to have saved them. Or the one that's the more obvious choice, which is the super horn, which is that new item in this game that blasts away anything that comes anywhere near you. At, but it's like super rare, so yeah, that's where the catch comes in. Alright, so here I have a green shell. At least it'll defend me. Um, you know, uh, and it's already gone. I'm not sure if I hit into an item and it destroyed it, or if I accidentally left go of the L button. I don't even remember. I, I'm not even really I just got noticing that much. What? I just got Canlis in a run. Oh, wow. You know how much Canlis relates to this game? It's pretty amazing, actually. And it's also amazing how I'm definitely not being sarcastic right now. But yeah, guys, Cannon List is actually like just like a speedrun trat. So, in Super Mario 64. 64. Jake's speedrun trats are strategies that you use to get better times. Yeah, obviously. Mm. Speaking of speedrunning, we both have our speedrunning channels, so you might want to go check out those, you know, via a link in the description Mine's more below. Mine's professional, haha. <laughs> no, I mean, That's I'm just because you're better at making art than me, because you have a better software and stuff. Yeah. Or maybe it's just that you know what to, you know what to do more with yours than I know. Yeah, cause I, I can probably do something like that with GIMP. Yeah, if you knew how to use GIMP, like I don't even really know everything about GIMP. That's probably why I'm not the best at it. I know the basic stuff. I remember when I figured out how to outline text, I was like so excited. I thought I was like a professional artist, <laughs> just because I could put like a black outline outside of text. All right. Well, I think this uh, is pretty fitting for you to. Uh, do a little talking about your new Let's Play here, because we're on the Twisted Mansion course, so, uh, you want to talk about that a little bit? Uh, I might lose my run, but, yeah. I'm doing a Let's Play Luigi Mansion after not coming back for, like, two months. It's... Yep, so, uh... I'm hoping it's to... It's been a long time. I'm going to be doing a speedrun. Uh, speed, I'm going to start doing speedruns of every... After... Okay, here's my plan for speedrunning. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not allowing myself to do a speedrun of a game unless I've completed the game in a Let's Play. Like, I mean, that, that's if I want to Let's Play it, like, eventually. Because mm. it, it'd be really stupid if I was going to do Speed on Luigi's Mansion and then like play through the whole game. Because then I'd be too good at it. <laughs> I mean, I'm already good enough at the Let's Play. I know what I'm doing. But I'd be a lot faster if I was doing Speed on Strats. It's a good option. That's actually what I'm going to do too, probably. Uh, with uh, Sunshine and Luigi's Mansion. And 64, I already speedrun that game. But I'm not good enough where it would really affect it if I did a Let's Play of it. So I could still do a Let's Play of it, I guess. And, uh... Luigi's Mansion... Dark Moon is out. Ooh. Yeah. Because you want to get a 3DS capture card, right? Yeah. Well, it's not like any new news that the game has I know, you like, been out you for like, like a year yeah, and you, a half. You were acting like it was so exciting. I know, like, it's been out for like a year and a half almost. And I'm like, oh, it came out, yeah. Like, Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon just came out. <laughs> a year and a half ago. Hey, did you know that the original Luigi's Mansion came out just 13 years ago? <gasps> it just came out 13 years ago, that game. <laughs> 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 I 
whenever I see the shell icon, like, while I'm holding one behind me, and then there's also one, like, up at the top left corner, I think that I have a second shell, like, a backup one, because I'm so used to Mario Kart Damn Wii, because that's definitely the Mario Kart game that I played the most. It's probably my favorite. Might be tied with Mario Kart 64 for my favorite. But I don't know, that's... I don't even think it was my first Mario Kart game. I think my first was Mario Kart DS, but Mario Kart Wii just, like, stood out to me. I thought it was a really good game. I know the bikes were overpowered, but everything in that game, just, like, all the tracks and everything just felt, like, so amazing. I don't know. Maybe it's because that was, like, what I spent. That was the one I played the most during my childhood, I guess. Maybe that's why I liked that the best, but I don't know. But anyway, we're here on our last race now of the Flower Cup already. I'm so scared. It's better be a PB. I saw that headman talking. I'm kind of like here for no reason almost. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that. Featuring Super VGX, who isn't even paying attention to the video because he's too addicted. You're, you're, you're the one who said I could go and get a PB. Uh oh. Oops. And I'm doing a, I'm, an, I'm actually on a really good run, but despite the mess up I just did. You realize that I'm gonna need that audio recording, right? Since you're recording yeah. your audio. Oh yeah, yeah. Cause, I know. Cause guys, I am too uh, not professional enough. Uh, that's not even really a, the right way to word it, is it? No. But yeah, I'm so unprofessional that I can't even like record a Skype call. So I need him to record his audio separately and then send it to me via Skype, so I can then edit it into the video. Which means that if you keep doing this run, you're just gonna send me like an hour long recording and it'll just have like Super Mario 64 sounds. That'll actually be hilarious. Hold on. If that's what it turns into. Okay. I'll be quiet. Oh god. Oh Jesus. Oh dear lord. Oh dear You could do this. You got the. I hate. Oh. <coughs> and I'm I'm assuming that you might have not made the run the right thing. In the run. It's all right. You just gotta practice more. At least you're not as bad as I am. Yeah, you have to censor though. What I just said. What? You have to censor what I just said. No, I'm not. What do you mean? You know what I just said. No, you didn't say anything. You said, oh, Jesus. No, I said... <coughs> no, you didn't. Yeah, I did. I said it like three times. Well, it didn't pick it up. <laughs> really? Can you just stop? <laughs> Please, you know how hard this is? Like, to edit. I got to censor out a lot of that. <coughs> yeah, I am going to, actually. Now you just made my life- yet yeah, you're giving me five minutes of extra work so I could just freaking edit out what you said. Like, why? Why are you doing this uh, to me? I made this episode like- <coughs> I, I, I'm gonna get out of here now. Bye. No, don't leave the video. Come on. Uh... Alright, well guys, uh, I guess I should just be talking about this game now since this is the last lap of the whole Grand Prix. But, alright, here it is. Uh, Shy Guy Falls- I haven't really been talking about this course at all because we were talking about Super VGX's speed running problems. But uh, now we're here, and it's kind of cool because in the music, if you listen right here, when you pass the Shy Guys, they actually sing along to it, which is a really nice touch uh, that Nintendo put on the game. And I am doing terrible in this race. I got third. Ouch. Did I even come in? Okay, good. I still came in first overall, though, right? And I probably got a star rank. I think I only got one star, though, uh, this time, because I think it's each place you go down. Like, you could have two second places or one third place, and then you get one star. And if you have, like, one second place, you get two stars. So you gotta be careful with uh, those rankings that you're getting if you want to get at least three stars on everything. Or even one star, you have to be careful. Uh, make sure you win all those races. Do everything you can. Uh, because you could get first without even getting a star. It is possible. Um, and you need those stars if you want to get the gold parts. I think it's the gold cart that you get when you get a star on every Grand Prix in the game. I'm not sure. 
But alright, here it is. First place in Mario Circuit, first place in Toad Harbor, first place in Twisted Mansion, and third place in Shy Guy Falls. Alright. So, uh, we, oh, 700 coins, a new vehicle has been unlocked, alright. So, it didn't say the new character because, uh, as you probably saw before on the character select screen, um, I went ahead and I unlocked Ludwig, uh, on my own time. So, I already have him. I felt like doing another 100cc gram for you, uh, in between these recordings. But, alright guys, that's it for this episode. Um, next episode we'll be taking on the Star Cup. And it'll probably be a little bit less about Super Mario 64 speed running. Uh, I don't know how you guys feel about that. Um, but if you do enjoy that, you can check out my speed running channel where I will be posting up times for Super Mario 64. And also Super BGX's speed run channel as well. And if you want to check out his Let's Play of Luigi's Mansion, uh, you can check out that too. I'll probably have links in the description for all this stuff. It's going to take me a long time, but you know what? I'm going to do it. i got to put in these links and get you to go to these other channels, because they have some pretty cool content on them. So why don't you go check them out. Alright guys, that wraps it up for this episode. This is Tops, and I'm out.